Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Psychonauts with me, OXFU. Okay, excuse you. <laughs> Bless you. And tonight, on a very special episode of Psychonauts, uh, we shall be working to get a few more brains. Um, first of all, there's this brain right here, which... Huh, for some reason... I had a spy. Those I crows are scared of me. I wonder why. Could it have to be... It could have anything to do with me setting their uh, bird brethren on fire earlier in the game. Eh, look at him. Nah. <laughs> um. Behind you. Shoot, we gotta wait for them to come back. <laughs> I think there was a brain up here that I can get in the meanwhile. Perhaps. Perhaps. Maybe. No. No. Play anymore. We have to wait for them to. Come on, one more crow. That's all we need. Then I'll go back down. Cause uh, yeah, basically we gotta use invisibility. Come on. Come on. Just come back down. Crows, come on. Wow, one of them, those crows, is no really, way. really doesn't want to go back. Where's that bugger? Got him on the run now. I don't think we have to scare him out, do we? Or anything like that. I don't even know where he'd fly off to. Jeez. All right. Well, I've got an idea. Let's uh, clairvoy the heck out of that. Oh wait. Here we go. Well, yeah, one's there. Big deal. We're looking for a couple more. Jeez. Alright. Well, you know what? These guys are going to be a pain in the butt. We're going to be a pain in the butt back. We're going to get that. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. We're going to get this here brain. Because they're not going to give us the other brain. What is up, eh? What is up indeed? Hey, Chops. Getting your brain back so you can uh, go hang out with JT again. I think that's his name, right? Alright, well, since they're not coming back, let's leave and come back. Ah, oh, I don't want to do this. I want to just get those brains. Go back to Ford Crawlers and just... Yeah, <laughs> Crawler. Every time I say his name, I think of donuts. <laughs> No! No! Damn it! Why didn't that work? I thought we'd just go up to them and, uh... Well, I tried, uh, telekinesis, but that didn't work. So I figured, hey, I guess we just go up there while invisible and smack the hell out of them. But that didn't work either. Yeah, look it. Oh, well, we do just I'm whack it. Brain doesn't go invisible when I get close to it. Yeah, but we had to get invisible to get it, so. Alright, so I think that is all of the brains in this area. Let's just, uh, make sure. Take a quick survey of the area. Whoa. There we go. I don't think there's any brains in here. No, 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 we're good. Right, so. Ford Crawler! Pick it away! Uh, we need to regroup, need to regroup at, H back at HQ. Exactly. Prepare for extraction. Just real quick, you know. Take care of a few, uh, few little things before we head back out. Um, wait, do we have any psi cores? Aha! We have some uh, mental cobwebs. I forgot about that. Aha! We've got enough enough psi cards do we have a uh... put that away my cobweb duster is empty I need to go extract more cobwebs from people's minds yeah I'm not looking to empty the cobweb duster I'm looking to yeah there we go psi cores so we can get psi challenge markers there we go one more in the bag what are we up at 65 no we're at 63 almost 65 now there are a hundred levels to get through 
So you can use that as a rough estimate of how far we are through the game. Um, I'd say we're more around... A little more than, than two-thirds of the way through. Um, maybe, yeah, like, okay, two-thirds is actually quite good enough, I guess. Anyway, let's get some brains yes. inserted. I got a brain. Good. Now? <laughs> now, so, now you can, can do things. We are in some bad trouble. Sounds like it's time something bad happened to our fine coach. Well, let me tell you what our plan is. Please, you have your plan, I have mine. But, say no more. And my plan is having Mikhail do yeah. stuff. Mikhail do stuff. Okay, here's the plan. I'm gonna go get on the coach's radio and call for help. See, now that's an excellent idea. Apparently, Why Chloe everyone be so helpful? is also yeah. the... I modified the antenna, Only so now it broadcasts straight into outer space. Oh, man. Okay, see, that's not actually helpful, so, but she's the only person questions? who actually helps Is us. Elton okay? Well, he'll be fully brained soon, I promise. When he comes out, tell him I'm waiting for him down by the docks, okay? You know, hey, do you want to help us save the... Yeah, you, you could help us, you know. Someone who could go invisible for indefinite periods of time your brain in might be helpful. Was my highest priority. You know... I'll bet if JT wasn't so distracted, this wouldn't have happened. He's probably with that prissy little show pony right now. <laughs> no. Actually, I think her mind's on other things at the moment. We haven't hmm. gotten her brain back yet, well, I don't maybe think. maybe I'll go see what's up. One of us at least should be guarding the sleeping quarters. You could help us. Agent Crawler? Jeez. What is the current situation? Have we gotten her brain back yet? Wait, I don't know. I wanted I to look. Go. Lots of work. Good luck. I wanted to look. Who we got left? Yeah, we haven't gotten her, her brain back yet. We haven't gotten Mikhail's yet. Um, <laughs> we haven't gotten Vernon. We haven't gotten quite a few people, but uh, no big Agent deal. Color? What is the current We've got situation? about half the brains. Anyway, ready, ready to go back to go in the, back field. the field. Yeah! Okay, let's see if I remember exactly where you were. I wish I knew the A-Team theme. I'd sing that. We are on our way back to town. <laughs> Excuse me, sir? My name is Napoleon Bonaparte. I think your name's oh, Fred. Uh, excuse me. Mr. Bonaparte. Shh. I only think I'm Napoleon Bonaparte. Do not listen to the weakling. He denies his lineage because he feels it. I like your jacket. Very strappy. You want it? You can have it. Just help me undo these buckles in the back and I'll... Sure, what are no you problem. Doing? The uniform of this army is sacred. We shall wear it proudly until the battle is over. Help oh. Me. Oh, shoot. Oh, I'm gonna lose. I'm um. Gonna... Sure, I I can help you. Um. I lose. I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose. I got a way to do that. First, I want to check if there's any th new things with Lily. Really? Uh, well, I reviewed your chart, little girl, and the bad news is we're gonna have to remove your brain. Strap it into an armored. No, same thing. Still, uh. I think that's the same cutscene, isn't it? Pretty sure it is. Anyway, well, we know how to help you, Fred. Oh, no. You are a stinking disgrace to your family, stinker. Jeez. Watch your language. We're just gonna, you know, do the same we did with Gloria. And just, uh, jump Sac into your brain. I have been hit! Probably a bad idea, again, because you're insane, you know, in an asylum. But, yeah, couldn't. Things probably won't go wrong. <laughs> this is actually one of my favorite levels, so I'm kind of excited. <laughs> this is it. The entire level takes place in this room. Oh man, I love this room. I love this room. There's so much in here. Like an apple, a so a chaise lounge, sofa, whatever. A little Napoleon figment. Glow. Oh, look at how much is in this room. It's so much more than everything else we've ever seen packed into a room. Like we've got like 12 figments in one room. Jeez, look at that. That's another chaise lounge and a footstool. Oh, man, there's so much in this room. Oh. Hello. Who's winning? Nobody's winning. 
Want to know who's losing? The Bonaparte family name! Look, I forfeit, okay? You win. Napoleon Bonaparte wins again. Is that the real Napoleon Bonaparte? I mean, the imaginary real <laughs> Napoleon Bonaparte? Yeah, I'm actually related to him. Can you believe it? Shut up! Stop telling people that simple fact. I don't even want to be here. That when this sad excuse for a Bonaparte lost a simple game of war to a feeble-minded invalid, I just could not take it anymore. I was forced to take control, and I will stay in control until I beat the love of victory into this degenerate swan who dares to call himself a Bonaparte. No, really, great, great, great grandpa Napoleon, I do love victory, like, a ton. <laughs> I love, I love it, it so much. this much. You can go now, I swear. Your move. Oh, man, looks like we're at a... Bit of a standoff then. Huh, I wonder what we can do. Huh. No idea. Let's talk to Fred for a second, see what Who's we winning now? What do you think? Oh! We can go into the game! I knew that. <laughs> no, I didn't know that. I just was feigning ignorance, as I am wont to do. Um, no, I was gonna say, like, I like I like this also. This? My lazy opponent is actually trying to win? He has sent in reinforcements. Oh, there you are, well, well, then let the game truly begin. Send in my best soldier. You, destroy that bridge for France. For France. I hate your stupid bridge. This is how much I hate you. Ha <laughs> ha. Suck on that bridge. <laughs> ah, yes. Now I shall go torment this poor peasant over here. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, oh poor man, farmer. now look. The bridge is broken and I can't move my pieces past it anymore. I quit. What pieces? Napoleon, you win. No, we don't forfeit. We're gonna beat you, Mr. D genetic memory of Napoleon Bonaparte. Ha <laughs> I like your je ne sais quoi, your joie de vivre. Maybe you will teach my long-legged nincompoop a lesson, eh? <laughs> Alors. Je ne sais quoi? I don't know what that means. <laughs> Um, no, I, I, I like, um, like the whole interaction as well between Napoleon and Fred Bonaparte. Oh, I'm just going to collect a few figments while we're out here. Um, just because it's, it's more realistic. Oh, I never noticed the huge sunglasses, or the huge, not sunglasses, regular glasses. Jeez, there's no tint here. Um, it's more realistic of what, um... Of an actual relationship with a famous person, like how, um, who was it? Einstein's son, or, yeah, Einstein's son? I think he had only one son, wasn't it? Or he might have had two. No, he had two. Einstein's sons always, um, like, they love their dad, of course, but they, they, they didn't like being <laughs> his sons because they had to live up to him. It was only, like, once the grandson rolled around that they, they started taking advantage of the name. Anyway, if we go over to the one of these and I think click on it. Yeah, we'll zoom right in and be like, hey, farmers, give us some help. Hello, I'm recruiting for the army of Fred Bonaparte. Hey, come on, we need a militia. Away. Fred Bonaparte has forgotten the people and we have forgotten him. What? Fred loves the people. He was just telling me that some of his best friends are, um, the people <laughs> he has abandoned us he doesn't care if we live or die look i'll tell you what i'll talk to fred i'll talk to him and i'll prove to you that he cares about the common man and that the fight is not meaningless i'll believe it when i hear it from him man some of my favorite people friends are people too i'm trying to remember how we actually get out of here <laughs> um well, I mean, not, like, out of the game, but, I mean, how we actually get out of the, uh, the small, <laughs> the, the small perspective that we have. Oh, shoot, come on. Come on. These guys are also fun enemies, because you can't actually kill them, as you can tell by their shell-like exterior, but... I think that's the only way you can actually take care of them. Yeah, look, you drowned. <laughs> that's so terrible. Oh, yeah, look, you drowned. Uh, I'm pretty... Oh, jeez. 
Oh, come on. I want to get up there. There we go. Whoops. Ah. I'm pretty sure that the way we get up is by, um... Oh, no, that's right. That's right. That's the way we get up. What we gotta do is we gotta pound, pound on those. But... Before we do that, let's grab one of these. Let's grab a couple of these, you know. There we go. Ah, oh, so happy. Oh god, I just realized that that might be misconstrued as a quote. I wasn't trying to quote someone, I was just being like, oh look, they're happy. That's nice. Jeez. Get off my back, even though you're not on my back. All right, so we need an engineer. Oh, look, Carpenter's Place. Maybe he'll be able to fix the bridge, you know? Because, I mean, we can we can ensure the people, that Fred loves the people as much as we want, but they can't get across the bridge. So that's gotta be our first priority. So let's go talk to this guy. There we go. Talk to the Carpenter. Ah, oh, no, don't undust the Carpenter. There. Any Carpenter's home? Go away, burglar. I'm not a burglar. I'm a recruiter for Fred Bonaparte's army. We're a little light in our corps of engineers, see? Listen, I know you're a burglar. I've been listening to your footsteps on my roof all night trying to break in. But why don't you just slide down the chimney? I got a nice fire going for you in here, Mr. Burglar. But wait. Okay, if I'm a burglar, then how can I be down here talking to you and up on the roof at the same time? Maybe you're a ventriloquist. Listen, if I go see what's up on your roof I and am. take care of it, will you come out and help fight Napoleon? Thank you for noticing. <laughs> Maybe. Good enough. All right, so we got to go take care of some sensors on top of his uh, top of his roof. This part's fun. Really, this part's fun. Really, this part isn't that fun. <laughs> So we gotta deal with sensors blasting at us while we make our way across. Aha! Uh -huh. More luggage! There we go. There we go. I'm trying to remember how we get up there. Okay, maybe we have to... Yeah, I guess we do have to go up on the farmer's house. Never mind. Maybe we'll be a burglar to him. Um... Perhaps I should leave this off until next time as well. Aha! Can we use the smoke? Yes, we can use the smoke. There we go. That's using our noggin. Look at Oh, there we go. Forgot we could use the smoke. <laughs> Love the thing, though. Alright, let's wait for this guy. Mustachioed guillotine. Oh, wait, he's not gonna let us buy. That's right, because we gotta... Can we... No, we can't... Oh, darn, that's too bad. I was gonna say, can we use uh, clairvoyance on him? But no, I guess not. So we're gonna use invisibility. Set marksmanship up as well. There we go. I guess he can't cut a uh, an invisible head. <laughs> All right. Let's... Come on, come on. Oh, come on! Can we get? Can we hit this guy? Jeez. There we go. I knew we could do it. If only we tried. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. They're dressed as French people. <laughs> well, French generals. You know, the, with the with the hat and all, and I can't see anymore. <laughs> this guy needs a duffel bag. Oh, darn. I thought we had the duffel bag tag. Oh, shoot. You son of a bitch. I'll get you for that. All right, I got you for that. Anyway, let's uh take care of one more guy. How do we, uh, lock on? I forget. Oh, well, it's not important. He's dead. Oh, that's the wrong one. I want levitation. There we go. There we go, indeed. All right. And let's get some, uh... What is this? What is this? Fred versus Crispin. Ah, Fred. Looking much cleaner, except for those bites out of your shoulders. Oh, and that's Crispin in the back, is it? Is it? No, I guess not. Oh man, Crispin, you're a wreck. 
Ah, oh. man, Fred, you are, you were pretty nice. Even as an orderly, you're not, you, you are nothing like those orderlies in, uh, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. Um, huh. Oh my god. Fred, you lost, and he, you, he didn't even have any hands. <laughs> he didn't have any hands, Fred. How could you be such a disgrace? Oh, shoot. No, I wanted, I wanted to get... I, no. Bounce. Bounce, goddammit. There we go. I wanted to get up here. Can go any higher? No. There we go. I've always wondered how to get that one figment. I think if we roll down here, we can get the rest. Come on, come on. There we go. It's pretty hard to get as far as I remember. Alright, there we go. We took care of those burglars, so now this carpenter should help us. Okay, you can come Let's out. See? Come on. Burglar's gone. Wow. You're pretty tough for a ventriloquist. Yeah, I am. Okay, here I come. I threw my voice, and, you know, it was a throwdown. Just show me where there's some wood to work <laughs> on, and I'll go to town. Oh, yeah. Here we go. We got a carpenter. And next time, we'll use that carpenter to uh, repair a bridge. Next time on Let's Play Psychonauts with Mio X Fu. Take it easy, guys. Oh, darn it. That was supposed to be all cool and be like, woo. There we go. <laughs> all right.